Year three, she's big, she's long, she's super hard top. She's as pretty framed a cow as maybe came out today. She's just uh, made so well in that frame. Uh, and she's had a couple calves and that udder is super well attached, uh, beautifully blended four udder on this uh, young cow as well. And then we pulled this senior three year old out, a different style of cow. She's got a tremendous mammary system on her. You just love to stand behind this cow and look at that height and width of rear udder attachment, the way that four udder blends into the body wall and the tremendous power. I think she's the kind of a cow we'd all love to have in our barns. I'm gonna go out, I'll congratulate your intermediate champion of the junior show, followed by the reserve and the honorable mention in that order. And certainly show them your appreciation for these young people. For us, as, uh, as we watch these young cows come out, this fall yearling in milk is just right on. Uh, you know, she started the day today. She hit the ring. Uh, she's first or second animal in the ring this morning in this show. And wow, she just, she caught our eye right away. She's got that frame that's ready to roll. She's open ribbed. And for a fall yearling in milk, just check out that rear udder. It's high. It's wide. It's beautiful center support. It's uh, well attached and way up above the hocks. So you can just see this cow developing and developing. And I think, uh, to me today, just a little more uh, ready in that rear udder, a little more rear udder development uh, for her age than, this, uh, than the junior three-year-old that follows her in reserve. Just love the frame on this cow. And that's what gets her over the, the senior two-year-old that I made honorable mention, this uh, senior three, just harder over that top, just stronger behind the point of the shoulder. She's just got that beautiful, stylish frame on her. Congratulations. So for the 2019 International Guernsey Show, the intermediate champion female of the junior show is number 1664, Thurston Farms Primetime Trixie, Katie Livingston, West Winfield, New York. Our reserve champion is number 1724, Warwick Manor, Miss America, Kayla Carley and Colby Stoltzfus, East Earl, Pennsylvania, with honorable mention going to number 1702, Warwick Manor, LS Suite, Kayla Carley and Colby Stoltzfus, East Earl, Pennsylvania. Congratulations, everybody. This time I'd like to introduce our entrance for Intermediate Champion Female for the International Guernsey Show for 2019. Number 1664 is Thurston Tar Farms Primetime Trixie, Katie Livingston, West Winfield, New York. 1670 is Prairie Moon T. Gun La Rosa's, Leslie Syveson, Walk on Iowa. Number 1679 is Spring Hill Mentor Joyce, Spring Hill Farms, Big Prairie, Ohio. 1678 is Snyder's HP, GG Pie Ashton, Prairie Cream and Valley Gem, Cumberland, Wisconsin. Number 1703 is Up the Creek, Toby Cadiddle, Karen Anderson Johnson, Lester Prairie, Minnesota. 1702 is Warwick Manor LS Suite, Kayla Carley and Colby Stoltzfus, East Earl, Pennsylvania. 1721 is H. Broke Levi Tate, Spring Hill Farms, Big Prairie, Ohio. 1714 Valley Gem Luck Deidre, Valley Gem Farms, Cumberland, Wisconsin. 1733 is Spring Hill Kojak Unique, Spring Hill Farms, Big Prairie, Ohio. And 1727 is Prairie Moon Sydney Sugar, Valley Gem and Gold Rush, Cumberland, Wisconsin. The Eugene Nelson Intermediate Champion Award is presented in memory of Alan and Mardell Sievert by Badgers Drift Guernseys, Stephen Sievert and Philip Keller of Madison. Our champion banner is presented by Bovatech, Guelph, Ontario, Canada. And the champion rosette is presented by Genovations Lodi. Our reserved intermediate champion female award is presented by Ag Pro Incorporated, Paris, Texas. The reserved champion banner presented by Bovatech, Guelph, Ontario, Canada. 
and our reserve champion rosette is presented by Rivendale Farms, Bulger, Pennsylvania. Good luck, everybody. And over in the International Red and White show ring, Judge Black has completed his placings in our senior three-year-old cow class. He'd like to recognize those juniors in the class. 
Second place junior is entry 2515, King Lane Abs Always Red, exhibited by Schaefer, Jackson, and Waldock of Little Falls, Minnesota. First junior in the class is entry 2530, Mackland T.S. Juliet A. Red, exhibited by Grady and Lane Wendorf of Exonia, Wisconsin. Placing third in the class is entry 2527, Ms. Apple Adriana Red, exhibited by West Coast Holsteins, Chilliwack, British Columbia. Second in the class is entry 2522, she also wins the Bread and Owned Award, Linehan Prin Fahrenheit Red, exhibited by Matt Linehan of Hillsdale, New York. In winning the class and also named Best Utter and winning the Production Award is entry 2531, Rosedale, Pretty Fancy in Red, exhibited by Balwig Hickory Hills Dairy of Dane, Wisconsin. Congratulations. Jamie, your reasons on the class. Another nice class of cows here in our senior three-year-old class, and again, uh, some variances all the way through. But our cow and first logical winner for us, a cow that's extremely well balanced. A cow that has an advantage over the cow in second. She just got more height, more width to that rear udder, showing us so much more definition of that suspensory ligament today than this extremely balanced cow here in second. The cow in second over the cow in third, a cow that's showing us a little more width, more power all the way through. She's got a little more udder quality and udder texture to this extremely dairy than this extremely dairy cow coming out in third. The third place cow over the cow in fourth, a cow for us that has a definite advantage in the way she moves around the ring. She's so much more comfortable and moves around her udder a little nicer than this big cow here coming out in fourth. The fourth place cow over the cow in fifth, a cow that's got so much more width all the way through her front end, more depth through her front end and carries that depth all the way back through. But when we get behind her, this cow is just so much deeper. That suspensory ligament showing us so much more udder quality and udder texture today than extremely stylish dairy cow in fifth. Fifth over sixth, a cow just carrying her milk a little higher today than this recently fresh third calf cow here in sixth. Thank you.